lesson is going to be the very basics of routing and views, what they are and how they help us define HTML templates like this page. This is our home page. How is this working? If we go back to our project files, we open up our routes and then we go to the web.php file. You can see that we say route git backslash and then it returns a function. And this function simply returns the welcome view. Do you think we're able to change this route? And what happens when we do? Well, let's simply change it to welcome and test it out. Now, back in our browser, when we reload our page, we get the 404 HTTP error code. This means that that endpoint, that URL, is not found. But if we go to our welcome endpoint, there it is. We just properly defined a different route or a different URL to access our welcome page. Back in our routes, let's change that back to what it was because we want a home page. And let's check this part of our code out. What's going on here? Well, it's a simple function and it's returning the welcome view. The view is going to be the actual HTML code that users of our application see when they land on this URI or that endpoint. How do we find that HTML? Well, let's go over here to resources. Within resources, we want to open the views subdirectory. And then we see a welcome.blade.php file. And here it is. Here's the HTML that users see when they hit this endpoint. So let's go down here and let's just change Laravel to Laravel 7 from the ground up. And we go back to our home page and reload that page, we'll see Laravel 7 from the ground up. Laravel routing is extremely powerful. For example, imagine if you want to add your own home dashboard HTML page for users. All you have to do is go back to the files, return to that route slash web dot PHP endpoint and define a new route. We're going to call this home. This is going to be the user's home dashboard. Within that callback function, we're going to say return and then view home. Now, if we were to try to hit this endpoint right now, what do we get? Check this out. Slash home returns view home not found. More than that, we get home was not found. Did you mean welcome? So it tries to tell us exactly what the problem was and what the solution may be. And it offered welcome because welcome is the only view template we have. So to fix this, we simply need to create home.blade.php. Now, what we're gonna do is we're simply gonna go up here and I'm gonna copy this HTML over from our welcome. I'm gonna remove that part and then we're gonna finish up this HTML. Body, body, head, head, there we go. I'll say title is user home dashboard. That's a meta tag. And we're going to create this div. And within this div, we're just going to make a name up. We're going to say Sam. Now, when we go back to our browser and reload the home URI, we get Sam. And we can prove its HTML by simply opening this up and seeing the div we created. But there's more. What if we didn't want to return an HTML template? What if we didn't want to return a view? Check this out. You can simply go right here, remove view, and let's just return Sam, just the string of Sam. Now if we reload the page, we don't have our divs and we still have Sam. It just returns a string. More than that, if we click over to our network tab, 
And we're going to see text slash HTML right now, right? And our content type is we just returned a string. But if we want to return JSON, which will be useful later on to build out stuff like APIs, well, <laughs> Laravel automatically sets that up whenever we just return something that should be JSON instead of HTML. So we're going to return an associated array where the key is name and the value is sample. Now if we reload our page, check it out. Over here, I actually have a Chrome extension to beautify this, so it might look a little different. You can prove that it returned JSON by going back to your network tab, hitting on home, and checking out the content type, application slash JSON. Then of course, if we went back to our home page, we still get our HTML, and we can prove that by scrolling down here, content type is text HTML. That is the very basics of routing and defining HTML blade templates within Laravel 7. Seven.